All right, what's up, Hot Squad? Welcome back. So it's now time for my last reaction for today. It is part three of Zeth Fire's Karate Kid re recap called Jaden Becomes Tim Smith. So if you succeed before, I've reacted to the last two, the previous two of his recaps. So I'm excited to see this, you know, and uh, yeah, this is going to be... It's going to be hilarious, man. It's going to be absolutely hilarious. Obviously, this is going to be a recap of the tournament or the, the final scene in the movie. So, I'm definitely excited for y'all. So, Hot Squad, without further ado, let's check out part three of Zeth Fire's Karate Kid reboot recap. Jaden becomes him Smith. Let's check it out. It's about to go down. And now, our feature presentation. Bro proceeded to hit this as if I'm gonna put Bryson Tiller on top of this hoe and slow it down. I am <laughs> not gonna edit you, buddy. And I'll wait a week and a half for part three, right? <laughs> so, we're back with the final Jaden video. I had to push this one back a little bit, I'm not gonna lie, because you two wanna snuff me by Damn. shadow banning the last video, <laughs> which is why it really didn't do that well. And not only that, I can't even try to promote this on TikTok because every single time TikTok sees some boxing, it take the video down. Damn, when that's it's crazy. clearly Ooh, that's fake. <laughs> I knew so it. I've been kinda <laughs> hesitant to make this one, but I'm gonna do it anyway because this is my favorite part of the movie. And best believe, I'm not gonna let YouTube stop me making what I wanna make, whether this flop or not the grind is still the grind and we all get back to exactly where we left off i'm in a good mood concrete smith i'm gonna rejuvenate your title back to Jaden. please don't <laughs> piss me off <laughs> never mind i can't even get the intro done because he already pissed me off because before the tournament tell me why jackie chan gives concrete smith bruce lee's <laughs> outfit so you're telling me bruce lee was a hoe that's exactly what you're know. telling me by doing this i'm sorry but what did he do to deserve <laughs> bruce lee's outfit bro getting dropped five times in the movie wow that is <laughs> so commendable you know what give muhammad ali shorts too man nah <laughs> we're not even two minutes in right. you know what let me calm down people have been saying that i have a hate boner for Jaden smith trust me i don't know this nigga he just pissed me off in this movie <laughs> but i'm not gonna lie his training was tough when i was watching this movie as a kid his training inspired me i used to be skinny as hell yeah. but if you see my IG <laughs> now wink, wink, nudge sweet. nudge i'm a whole tank and i gotta appreciate concrete smith for the one time yeah. when i was watching this film i was doing them decline push-ups he low-key the reason why i got my first pectorals so <laughs> shout out to you my boy as much as i hate i cannot forget an og now let's see if you could actually box when it matters now i already talked about this transition in the first video because i didn't think i'd be making three parts but i'ma play it again because it goes so hard yeah it does it's all transition masterpiece i love the yeah. sound choice that they picked yeah. and i really like the look of this tournament i'm not gonna lie it looked beautiful we just get here and then look at chang already violating bro, bro we, we just, just entered the building it hasn't even been 60 seconds somebody get this chalk eater off my screen please i don't know who he's fighting but that was actually boxing i'm not gonna lie that was going hit for hit and then chang does a little spin kick and this kid for some reason just stood there you saw my boy did a whole 360 <laughs> and he didn't even decide to block your left maybe well this guy right here proves that he's a fraud because i think he was just trying to glaze chang and make him look good yeah. just tell me why he gets killed you know and he makes himself flip right? to land on his I was, back I was to make it that. look more dramatic so dramatic really right that's so dramatic catch him, bro make sure you zip up his pants when you're done <laughs> hey man you know chang the moment he get a w he gotta do a death stare at Jaden. he knew he was about to pack him up well you know what it is man he get into the ring and then Jaden gets into his first actual fight i'm not gonna lie i'm getting kind of excited bro i'm going about to start boxing <laughs> small boy y'all just two fight. kicks oh, and then oh. the person that he's fighting is such an npc bro hits the villain default special move <laughs> the charge forward and scream and this gotta be the first character i ever seen in my entire life get intimidated by this <laughs> level one move man i thought it was good bro don't make me call you concrete again and get his ass back into the ring man because surely he's gonna do better in round two right no. no way my boy hit the jets nah man if i was jackie chan i would have been like embarrassing <laughs> no way my star pupil hitting this looney tune i run bro 
Come on now, you got Jackie Chan as your mentor. That's really what I mean when I'm saying Concrete is a complete and utter fraud. <laughs> but the next round start and he's actually boxing. Yes, bro. And this man hit the hang up your jacket move right on top of his opponent. And man, I'm not gonna lie, that was clean. No. My boy Concrete actually cooking right now, okay? So his opponent does a level one move again. And then look at this pose, bro. You see what Marvel's doing to the youth, bro? What type of Avenger-ass pose is this? You're not Thor. You, know, you got his whole fam rooting for him. His mom happy as hell. His girl happy too, and... Oh, God. No, no way. way. That's who I think it is. No if way. Y'all ain't seen part one. This is Jaden's best friend that abandoned him the moment he got dropped by Chain. But now that no, my boy Jaden finally at the top eating, now all of a sudden he's trying to get a bite off his plate? You're a fraud. <laughs> you fake as hell. Seriously. I'm telling you, someone better get this Koopa Troopa. <laughs> hit that nigga off my screen immediately before I go up there and do it myself. I completely forgot to mention this, but Jaden actually got his girl back. He really pulled up in front of her crib just like this. I want to take her out. She got to shut my door. Oh, hell no. She got to eat me up. She got, uh... <laughs> nah, he just like me for real. I did the same thing to the girl that curved me back in third grade, but instead I just got a restraining order. Mm -hmm. So we start yeah. seeing the other fights within the tournament, and I already talked yeah, about this part in part one, actually. Mm -hmm. And I posted this part on TikTok, and there were people really in the comments capping, just trying to make me look bad. I feel wow. like I say this in every video, but the moment y'all be behind your goddamn screen, you feel like I'ma just let y'all slide when I'm not. You had people like this in my comments talking about some, <laughs> you don't know how to do that. I could do that rather easily. Get off the ground first, nigga. <laughs> man, I'm sorry, man. It's just like oh, I never reply to these comments when they bother me. I need somewhere to vent it because oh. there's no way I'm going to let y'all just slide in and out like that. One yes. thing I know all y'all lame ass TikTok niggas cannot do, though, is this right here. Oof. I have to slow this whole down to really realize what was going on, bro. That was clean as hell. And then you got Chang yet again, bro. Mr. Brick Eater. And the <laughs> fight doesn't even have to start for me to feel the Black Air Force energy <laughs> coming that. out of my screen. Because they're doing the bow, and look at him! Hey, He's staring that. down little bro right here all types of crazy. He ain't even look all the way down. That should be illegal! Especially after he domes it in the face with this kick right here. Sweeps him and Sparta kicks him right in the chest damn. and has him folding like a lawn chair. God and damn. Even the movie is glazing him at this Jeez. point because why is this kick in slow it's motion? So dramatic, like, can y'all not see the writing <laughs> on the wall? He's him. And Jaden surprisingly cooking. He's out here blocking all his strikes and then he. Damn. Nah. Replay that real quick. Now, I know a lot of y'all just like, Zeph, he just threw him over his shoulder. It's not that deep. But someone with eyes like me knows exactly what he did right here. Let's flash back real quick. <laughs> Flips Jaden over. Doesn't this look familiar? Yeah, does, I was it? out here calling him Cement Smith this whole time. I should be calling you Jaden Uchiha. Because <laughs> this is exactly what Sasuke did when he sold Rock Lee's entire arsenal. And this yeah. ain't even the last time he does it. I guess maybe he did deserve Bruce Lee's gi. My nigga unlocked the Sharingan mid-training arc. And yeah. after all that, he poses too like, damn! Who would have thought I might actually start glazing concrete? <laughs> now this Mohawk kid right here, man, he's actually kind of move with it i'm not gonna lie if you see his fight right here he really went ballistics but every time you see him he's gonna push up his mohawk <laughs> and i promise you bro it's not gonna make it harder that cut is atrocious <laughs> who cut you the exotic barber no, hell i was nah. in line for that cut right behind xqc oh hell no nah. and this I don't even know why they added this scene. I'm gonna keep it a stack. Chang goes to fight this kid right here, and he literally just does a spin kick and knocks him out. I can't even call this a fight. This was literally yeah. three seconds. And y'all are still gonna <laughs> accuse me for glazing Chang when the movie is clearly doing it more than me. Because what reason was there to add this? It wasn't even that hard for real. I'm gonna keep it a stack. I can do that too. <laughs> and then here goes the Mohawk kid yet again. And he's actually fighting one of Chang's homies. And look at how he packs him. Bro hits him with with the sweep and he dodges but it was just a feint the whole time because he gets up and hits him with the roundhouse kick to the face hit bro so hard he started spinning 50 times in the air <laughs> hey look at the master bro <laughs> This old nigga tight as shit, bro. And here goes Jaden against one of Chang's homies. And I don't know about y'all, but I've waited for this one. This nigga been oh, pissing man. me off. This old groupie head ass nigga, bro. <laughs> They're about to box in. Look at what he does right here. 
Now, I don't know about y'all, but I didn't see a single reaction from anyone else because you are not him. If you are doing all this, you better be boxing crazy. My boy out there just flailing his arms everywhere. And Jaden moving out there like he a draft one pick for Weave Nation. Even Mr. Balloon Arms over here still cop this nigga. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty smooth. I'm gonna give you your props. When Jaden takes this hit and switches to the crowd, you see his mom trying to tell him to get up. And look at his girl's dad, bro. Someone get bro a map. I don't even think he knows where he's at. He really saw Jaden get hit like that and he hit the dad. <laughs> like, bro, who have... <laughs> Who invited this nigga, bro? And after this, Jaden starts teeing up crazy, blocking all of his strikes. And I would not have noticed this if I did not slow this down. But he just slaps bro. But he doesn't just slap bro once. He does it twice. Damn. And look at how high his hand was raised, too. I can't even call this fighting anymore. This is discipline. Jaden kicks his arm and then does a roundhouse kick to bro's face. That is one blunt already rolled up. This is the beginning of his lick back. He's here to restore all the honor that he lost. My boy went from Kong concrete to him smith now before we continue to the semifinals, every single time i post these videos this people are always picture. mentioning cobra kai and how cobra kai does not stack up to these i have yet to see more now, me personally kai i have not seen cobra kai whatsoever i know i am a fraud <laughs> The original Karate Kid and this Karate Kid is probably in my top 10 movies ever. Mm. And I haven't even seen the TV series that everybody I can see. I can definitely agree with that. this video, if y'all wanted to run down those, let me know. Because I was actually plotting to do the original Karate Kid as well. Because Which Daniel... You did. That's my next video. <laughs> you want to talk about fraud? <laughs> so the semi-finals start and then we got Chang versus... I'm not even going to try to pronounce <laughs> this. So Chang hits the bow, and once again, he don't even hit it. He just flexes his weak-ass supercuts haircut again. <laughs> He's really like them tattoo niggas. You don't have to <laughs> pretend to show us some other shit, bro. You see it, and it's still trash. You better box crazy if you care this much about your hair, bro. So the round starts, and it's the default villain move. The charge, scream, and strike. Well, he actually got Chang on the defense, and he's out here blocking everything he's dishing out. Chang really out here bobbing and weaving like crazy. And I don't even know what to call this, but Mohawk Kid hit some floor summer sauce, man. I don't even know what he was trying to cook. But he was doing all this flexing just to lose the high ground. And y'all never Damn. understand the meaning of losing the high ground until you are in the spot of Anakin. Because he lost all of his positional power. This led Chang to no. hard to kick this Damn. nigga in the chest. And look at how hard he hit, bro. He bounced on the floor too. I don't even know what to say because this man... <laughs> move on. So the second round starts and they start boxing again. And look at Chang weaving like, no, nope. grabs this man, Jeez. spins around his entire body Ooh. and puts him in a lock. And look at Chang's face. God damn. I almost dropped my entire mic. I don't even know what to say anymore. I could call him a brick eater, a crayon eater. I could call him whatever I want. It does not change the fact that this is the most nefarious kid I've ever seen on a screen. And look at Jaden staring at bro while he's fighting. He looking like he on the verge of tears. He does not want to enter the ring with bro again. And I do not blame him. You could literally make a horror movie out of him. <laughs> so Chang and Mohawk Kid start boxing again. Oh and Mohawk Kid uses this three-piece kick combo. And once I saw this, I already knew it was over. Over because you already did this bro was flexing his hair just for nothing nigga you garbage <laughs> this man has the same two presets in his technique list oh my god but once you do something like this it is just free east for chang because he's literally slapping bro at this point he want to be an african father so bad he kicks mohawk kid down and then look at the movie glazing again the slow-mo in the air while chang rises up and elbows him right through the chest it was Ooh. already wraps at Golly. this point, man. Ain't no way. And then we got Jaden against this kid right here. God this dang. is another one that I have been personally waiting for. This nigga was pissing me off, too. And before he steps out into the ring, his master stops him. And he starts talking like he's Bane. He's like, I want him broken. And not even this little nigga's trying to agree with that. But he steps into that ring regardless. <laughs> he starts throwing all these kicks as if he's Sanji. All Jaden's doing is deflecting all this. And once Jaden throws one yeah, we're in the like, in the I like. heard death whistling in the background because it was over. Yeah. Chris Rock has decided <laughs> your fate. This is Zero Smith extermination plan because this kid Ooh. starts going crazy Damn. on Jaden's leg. My boy Jaden meeting his long lost love yet again. The cement. Rewatching this scene, I don't even remember it being this long. He threw like eight chops right on his leg. You would think Fortnite mats would fall out of that. Damn. He 
gets disqualified, and rightfully so. He don't yeah. even show up for the rest of the movie, but I wish he did because Jaden should have packed this nigga. <laughs> Look at the master laying back. He's like, huh, all of the day's work, huh? Let me see you throw hands and see what's up there, nigga. <laughs> Yeah, chill, chill, chill. <laughs> the main match finally starts. Jaden versus Chang. I've been waiting for this one. The round starts and they start playing footsies. I'm not gonna lie. Chang jumped one time and then Jaden backed up like three feet. Chang finally starts us off with a kick and then they get to boxing. Before I even go any further, Jaden Smith hits him with the backhand as his first strike. That's what I'm talking about. Show that nigga. Chang kicks him to the side and they end up right back in the neutral game. This is looking a lot like Street Fighter 6. I'm surprised they're not throwing Hadoukens right now. I'm not gonna lie, I thought Chang was better than this, but even he got some NPC in him. Because even he is hitting the basic charge, yell, and strike. When has this ever worked? Chang throws a kick and then look at what Jaden does. Bro, I know y'all see that. Look! I don't know what oh, I missed. He really unlocked his Sharingan. <laughs> my man is really using moves that used to pack him. And this is when they actually start going crazy. They throw in everything they got in their command list. But this man is allergic to W's because he proceeds to hit the most light skin slide <laughs> I've ever crazy. seen. Bro proceeded to hit this as if I'm going to put Bryson Tiller on top of this hole and slow it down. I am Jeez. not going to edit you, buddy. And Chang saw that slide as free eats because he straight <laughs> dives at bro. Yeah. And then Jaden ends up flying off the platform. It gets folded like a lawn chair. Damn. I take back my comment. You are back to Cement Smith. Jaden put in a pose like this is actually heinous. And in the second round, Jaden decides to unlock his Sharingan. Next round starts and Chang is on the offensive. He throws this strike right here and Jaden out here showing better defense than a girl best friend trying to cock block you. Nah, cause I'm telling you they really be having the most impeccable defense. NFL offensive lineman head ass. But Chang throws Jaden's entire body to the right. And that right there sealed your fate. Because you got a black nigga on the floor, you know damn well he's gonna hit some moves. Out here moving like his dance dance revolution. And Jaden takes that opportunity to sock this nigga in the neck. And even the mentor was looking kind of shook like bro this man is going for the kill he is not like thor he's going straight for the head and i had to move up in my seat a little bit i'm not gonna lie because this this is a lick back bro not none of that water shit you were pulling bro so chain get up for round three and you could tell that nigga was hurt too oh no nah. i've been noticing this for a while now but i'm seeing these two standing next to each other bro the height difference is crazy see i don't know if concrete smith is like four feet or this nigga is like seven feet tall but this is crazy got this whole looking like a one piece final battle and chain I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of losing it, because look at how he's scrapping right now. He misses his entire hook, only for Jaden to kick him in the chest. Ooh. Now, Chang don't go down that he's easy. He does an entire flip, but that time alone was an opening for Jaden to jump on this nigga and completely flip <laughs> him over. Goes right to his face and then nails him again. Hmm. Man, this gotta be the biggest comeback of all time, I swear. He's moving like the Miami Heat in the 2016 finals, bro. Hmm. The offense like LeBron, but the defense Defense like Kyrie. I'm really gonna have to take back everything I said. This is him Smith. And in the final round right here, his master was asking for some nefarious works. Stuff even beyond Chang's power level. You see, Chang right here, he is a menace. But he respects the faith of a 1v1. He knew he would never exploit this man's leg, but the master ain't care. He just wanted to see the W no matter what. So Chang had to violate bro. Straight jumped and hit the sky just so he could Ooh, hit this nigga's fudge, leg. Man. And once again, the footage Damn, hits man. the slow-mo. Like they really want me to edit this right now or something. <laughs> I'm not budging. And the camera really slowed down like he hit the most elegant jump ever. This ain't nothing. I can do that too. But Jaden, like a real nigga, actually he gets back up. This had me straight flabbergasted. For all I knew about this little boy right here, he would have stayed down. But he got up, straight tears in his eyes, and he knew he was about to drop bro. And then bro proceeds to hit the craziest pose. And if you're going against anyone in any competitive arts, and they start posing, run. But I'm not gonna lie, this last little scuffle was something crazy. Because first off, this dodge was clean as hell. But someone directing this movie was clearly lying. Because I know damn well not a single nigga in this movie taught him this. But I'll tell Take this kick in the ending over the OG any day of the week. Cause Johnny saw this and he really got the best plan. Was to run straight at his leg. This man got Patrick Starr himself commanding his brain right now. You are trash. If I ever get to this movie, best believe I'm gonna violate you. But Jaden wins right here and the movie ends. I'm not gonna lie. Concrete Smith, you really redeemed yourself right here. There's nothing else for me to say. See y'all in the next one.
That was really good. Oh, no. That ending, that circuit ending might be that. See, I can't be the only person who watched this movie yeah. as a kid and Ultimate never ending. saw this ending. This is like some secret ending video game shit where you can only unlock it when you reach a certain level in life. Who has legitimately seen this? But well, the reason why I held off on the master was this right here. Bro was really trying to discipline all these kids for losing. If you really about that, go into the ring yourself, nigga. And Jackie Chan stops him. And the master's like, I know damn well you ain't just touched me, nigga. And this got even Jang scared because their hockey's going crazy. They moving like white beard and roger right now and they start boxing Jeez. see i never seen this, this type before fight. so i was watching this and i was straight geeking i was like yeah these niggas got hands <laughs> this is some pure jackie chan master class bro one thing that's really good about jackie chan's fights is that these fights have such great timing it's what makes a lot of these fights flow so well the fact that there's pauses with each and every single action it makes it feel a lot more kinetic Damn. even anime fights be moving like this there has to be a little rhythm to it you know what i'm saying and this fight got it but anyway these niggas was out here boxing with benches I don't even know what's going on no more I took my eyes off for three seconds And then bro was out here about to get choked out by a bench <laughs> trash. This man Jackie Chan really spares him too And he keeps trying to yeah. box Bro you're cooked It's over And you know he was cooked when Jackie Chan hit him with this kick right here Ooh, what the hell? I don't even think Jaden got folded that hard my boy You really just took the mantle And then once the fight was over Jackie Chan was really about to finish him off and then Jaden looks straight at Jackie Chan and he's like, I want to be Bryson so bad. And then once we get to this point, the movie actually ends. As I said earlier, this is one of my personal favorite movies ever. I had so much fun making fun of this nigga just for this series, bro. I appreciate y'all for all the support for real. Well, I guess me and Jaden are officially done. Sources say a new Oh, you mother oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's a single coming out. I did mention that before. I mentioned that before um, on my, um, damn. I think I mentioned on my Gran Turismo um, trailer that um, there's going to be another freaking Karate Kid reboot. Like, why? Just why, Sony? Why? But, yeah. That, that was a really good um, recast. Great recaps. But imagine, imagine if they bring Jay, Jay Smith and Kopa Kai. Imagine that crap. I want to see how people going to react to that. Hey, boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. You've seen bring his character back. Well, yeah, man. This was a really good recap. So, there you go, Hot Squad. That was uh, Zeph Fire's um, Karate Kid re recaps. W videos. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So, Hot Squad, there you have it. That was part three of Zeph Fire's Karate Kid re recap. JD becomes Hemsmith. So, overall, great recaps. Loved it, man. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Hilarious, dude. Hilarious. I can't wait to see more Zephyr's videos. I've been wanting to get a chance to see his Miles and Morales um, Spire Society video, but I'm hearing it's age restricted, so I'm going to have no choice but to watch it on my laptop because I somehow I can't watch it on my TV because it's going to skip right to it, which sucks. But I'm going to watch it on my laptop very soon. Trust me. I'm going to react to more of his videos. His videos are freaking awesome. And, of course, I got more reactions coming in the way in next week or so. So, Hot Squad, if you enjoyed my reactions of Zephyr's Karate Kid Reboot Recap, please hit the like button. Comment, share your thoughts. What is your favorite Karate Kid movie, obviously? Um, what's your favorite character? Um, I have Cobra Kai, obviously, like I mentioned before, the what will continue. I'm actually on season four right now, but I never got a chance to ever since. So, Hot Squad, this is Taurus up, signing off for the weekend. I will see y'all later for more reactions. And as always, safe out the sky. Peace out. Have a great weekend.